This is one of Jupiter's moons, Io, and from pole to pole, this thing is covered in volcanoes that are constantly erupting. Now, the Earth, you might have heard of it, has around 1,300 active volcanoes, but they are not, notably, constantly erupting like they are on Io. Why? And for that answer, we have to look at Jupiter. <laughs> Thanks back at the room, Joey. You're really starting to grow on me. Like a fungus? All right, oh, back man. to space. Jupiter is so huge, it outweighs every other planet in our solar system. So Io is tiny by comparison, about the same size as our moon. And speaking of our moon, you know how it controls the tides on Earth, pushing and pulling as it gets further and closer. Well, Jupiter does the same thing on Io, but instead of pulling water, it pulls the land. And this process is known as tidal <gasps> flexing. And it, one, squeezes the moon's insides like a juice box and Jupiter's trying to get the last drop. Lava. Which makes the lava pool under the surface pop out and spew everywhere. And tidal flexing too creates lots of heat, which excites some scientists because it's a way of generating heat when you're not really close to the sun, which is what you need for a habitable planet from what I hear. 